Good morning, everybody. It's Ramona. Welcome back to Walmart Wax Wednesday. A little late today, but that's okay. We're going to get to it. Uh, before we start, I want to show you my Halloween nails. This is the style called Bats Amore from Color Street Nails. And I'm currently hosting a Color Street Facebook party for my friend. They're little bats. Tracy. Um, so if you want to join into my uh, Color Street Facebook party, let me know down below. The party is going to be ending, I believe, Saturday at midnight. Um, so anyway, you can just go join the party, check it out, see what Color Street's all about. There's lots of tips and tricks there from Tracy. There's some, um, some of the, my, every time I do my nails, I post it. There's some other uh, photos on there for some nail inspiration. So go check it out um, if, if you choose to, let me know. Okay, anyway, back to Walmart Wax, Wax Wednesday. Today we are talking about Alter Sol Grotto, and this is in the Sensational's Dia de, la, de los Muertos collection. And this was chosen by Brian D. So, uh, thanks Brian, and let's see, sensas Sensational's description goes like this. Lively greens and shimmering citrus nestle with white pine and green cypress, wrapped with forest herbs and mosses, soft woods and musk. Okay, that's a lot. So we have greens, citrus, pine, cypress, forest herbs, moss, soft woods. So basically woodsy, herby, kind of that kind of business. I did not get any of the shimmering citrus and I was really hoping to get some of the citrus to kind of uh, break up all the woodsy herbiness in this. And it is very woodsy. It's musky. It's very masculine. Um, it is cologne -y. You know, sometimes I'll say it's cologne or it's kind of more like body wash. To me, this is like a heavy men's cologne that for me, I did not care for. I like kind of fresher things, but this was very musky, deep, uh, woodsy, um, which I don't mind those notes, but in this case, it just came out very cologne-like, a heavy cologne, like, like it would take you back a minute, you know, like or a second. If you walked into a room, it would just kind of like, whoa, what's he wearing? Like too much. Um, so, obviously, from what I'm saying, you can tell that I didn't care for this one. Um, yeah, I, I, yeah, I didn't care for this one. Um, I'm trying to think of something positive to say about it. It just wasn't my cup of tea. It was just too strong of a cologne note for my liking. But, you know, having said that, you know, if you like those strong cologne notes, this might be up your alley. Um, so, scent appeal for me out of 10, I'm going to say, eh, like, mm, like four-ish three-ish, four-ish, kind of down in that region. Um, throw, of course, because I don't like it, was very good. It's probably like an eight out of 10. So um, yeah, throws very well, um, just not something that I particularly care for, for my preference. But anyway, there you have it. Okay, so next week, our choices are going to be also from that collection, Pastel de Tres Leche, which is tree milk cake, which I don't like. Also from that collection is Champorado, which is Mexican hot chocolate, caramel apples, and Better Homes and Gardens orange cinnamon rolls. They look really yummy. Let's see how they, how they melt. Okay, I think that's everything for now. Um, as I said, actually, I'll just leave the link for my um, nail party down below. That way you don't have to, if you, if you want to check it out, it'll be right there for you to see. Um, Okay, that's it for today. I hope everybody's having a great Wednesday. I'm sorry I'm a little late today. I had to go and have four brand new tires on my car. So, unexpected expense there. Anyhow, have a great day, everybody. I'll see you soon. Bye.